video. So I did this uh, hair and makeup like this, hairstyle like this. <laughs> and trendy <laughs> also, so I chose to these shoes, uh, which is funky and uh, fun. Where did you get the shoes from? <laughs> <laughs> I do <laughs> like crazy <laughs> shoes so. Yeah, so I, I love your shoes. I would wear them. I would wear the dress. Ponytails, fine, you could experiment, but you don't. It's again overdoing. One thing I'm noticing is everyone is just overdoing it, and style is supposed to be sim simplicity and fun. I'm a and I chose to wear this weird this dress uh, because after having a look in the market in the mall, because you said that we need to wear denim, uh, a trendy denim outfit. I do have a lot of pair of jeans, but uh, an outfit for me is kind of a dress or a uh, similar color trendy. <laughs> um, I think we all noticing the same thing. The dress is beautiful, but it's more like, you know, if you could just have simple shoes, cowboy boots. You can never really wear shoes and purse different. It just doesn't go. I choose this outfit because I find it to be showing a woman's sexiness, yet an edginess and a wildness. The, re the ultimate reason behind this is back in Washington, D.C., I'm actually learning to ride a motorcycle. And I absolutely love sm sports motorcycles. So I find that this expresses the freedom of a woman on a bike. They're just accessories. I don't, I don't think you need the necklace. Okay. The rest is fine for me. While dressing up, I just had a pair of jeans and a t-shirt. And a shirt, formal shirt. So I just wanted to symbolize that women since ages have been a bar, uh, symbol of power and boldness in their own unique personality terms. Denim is timeless, it has transcended boundaries, it is ageless, any, any age person, and it is very comfortable. So if you have to wear this costume outside, where would you wear it? Would you ever go like this outside? Uh, if it is my friend's party, or maybe a party, I think I would be able to carry this outfit. You see, you bold enough to carry this outfit. Yes, I think so. My name is Wilfrey. I love denims anyhow. I love wearing denims. As I feel, uh, denims are very friendly clothes. You can carry them anywhere, anyhow. So talk about your outfit. What made you wear this outfit? <laughs> Honesty. Um, so there's no choice, huh? Anything just that'll make you look slim. Uh, I like your gold and the denim. You just can never do big earrings and this big. No, you just never do that. I try to play very safe, but your reason that I try to look slim. I'm sorry, Zira. The lighter colors make you look make them make you look slimmer. You would rather wear shoes that are darker. I'm using a combination of two dresses uh, and they have a story behind it. Uh, it's, um, it's an elegant fun. Uh, we are like in routine, we, are, uh, we have an optional life, we have work and all. And behind, uh, under this I'm wearing uh, the funky one, shorts with uh, this knotted uh, shirt. Uh, it's like uh, when we come to MI with you, various facets of your personality, you can explore your personality and all. So it's like the combination of two dresses. So I guess in Solon you can't wear these kind of dresses, right? <laughs> Not to the office. So MIBQ may be a platform where you do all the experiments and stuff. <laughs> and does they make you feel good? Yes. You know what? I, I, I'll tell you what. If you took off the top mm -hmm. and the better. earrings and you have the you know, little top and the shorts, maybe did you want to take off the top shirt? Are you comfortable? <coughs> Like, you know, that outfit is so cute. If you had just a basic, you know, um, <coughs> plain, simple tank top white or, you know, then you could have worn that layering. Okay. Yeah, just, yeah, I think uh, just before uh, the Selim Javi, she just asked me, should I wear this? So I was just telling her, don't actually, you're looking better off. But I didn't know that, you know, of course, you had a story behind. But I'm the mean from Tiana. Uh, and I'm wearing a denim jumpsuit and uh, I have a story behind it. It's a gift from my brother. It was a lucky gift. So it is really special for me. And I was really happy when you added this jumpsuit, uh, sorry, this denim round. So, and uh, the reason I'm wearing it is it's 
super comfortable that I can carry it off anyway. The bot is more added to it. I think it could be avoidable. Yeah, but as she said, I think the belt, the connection between the belt and your accessories is a little bit. If you did a white belt, we would it would still, you know. We are waiting for the perfect outfit, okay, that I will jump and say, oh my god, I want to wear this. <laughs> I have the same problem with the belt and the shoe foot wear and the neck so I will get rid of all of them. wearing it now, you are wearing it. Like she said, by yourself, it's fine. Or you have no mind it. Because belt is very common here. If you match it up with your foot wear. Even a scarf or something, you know, you could have just put the scarf in there. You could have come up with something, okay, if you don't have the belt, improvise. Thank you. It's comfortable and fashionable. You know, I love your overalls, but not your shoes. Your top is still fine. It's just a look. You would not wear the black heels with the summer top. Okay, thank you. This style is, I don't need to introduce myself. My clothes fix about me. And fashion is confidence. Whatever I wear, it should be, my skin should be confident about it. Like I'm wearing a normal one piece strip, I mean, uh, dress. I'm very confident about it. When I'm wearing, like I'm matching up with a cap, I just picked it up from the street from Paris. I'm confident. Whatever I do, I should be confident about it. I don't follow anyone for I'm fashion and for anything. I follow myself. Fashion is following myself. So, so Let's say, let's talk about your dress. So this is something, did you buy specially for the pageant or you had this before you wore I it? I had, I always liked a little sweet dress and I had this dress. See, I feel your hat is a little Not bit going, yeah. too much. So sometimes you don't have to try so hard. You know, you could have just done a high <laughs> ponytail and I think that fashion is something that's comfortable, beautiful and and you don't have to keep thinking about it. Oh my God, what to do with this? Or what to do with my hat? Fixing it. Yeah, for me, the hat looks an abstract. So some of the high ponytail is an abstract for me. And the other look shape could be a little more brighter. Would have made you look very good. I'll be back to paper in my coded. It's here. If you go into a street style, Cap is going to be fine with you, and uh, but I mean, the, the, lip, the lip color is the problem. And it's about I mean. You know, the guy told me if I wear a bright color because he did a very bright color eyes for me. So they look, it a which ki tarah lagogi. The lip color, the bonnet is style, and if you wonder about the hair, but yeah, if you are going for some like. Uh, Airport look is fine, but you're going to street style for the shopping or something, then the cap cap can have a rest. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And the dress, uh, the way you dress up, it uh, reflects your personality. That's what I hear today. So we're going to ask each one, we'll ask uh, a little bit about our outfit. Do you want to start, Neil? You start, I will be so you know, I have a question about your. How did you come up with the shoes? Mm -hmm. You know, there was denim and white. How did you match these shoes with the outfit? Uh, I like these shoes as a. <laughs> it has good uh, height actually. That's why. And the color. Color. So yeah, you, you thought of matching neutral with your multicolor, I guess. Yeah, I thought. It. So what's with the earrings? I saw you wear, wear earrings uh, even during the fitness round. Don't you think that would interrupt like, at that time? I have a question. It may be. But fashion is more important. No. Fitness is more important? Fitness is <laughs> OK. OK. So you, are, you have to choose the footwear because to enter your height, right? Yeah. OK. So it had nothing to do with the matching of the costume? Uh, I think uh, 
idea why that's why uh, some color will go with it that's why okay and the design and we you think that color will go with yeah it. and you said something about hot print with the fashion so is there hot print actually something with fashion so yes, something of wearing like a, a jangri or a full costume where mm -hmm. you are not showing it is not fashion uh, i think uh, it is fashion actually what i love i wear that's what we are Even if you're wearing a simple coat of pajama or a suit, that is fashion. It's about how you carry that off. It's not yeah. about what kind of the fashion. Yeah. Anything else? Yeah, I had a costume here in Mumbai, Canada, and uh, well, yeah, um, I had a pair of jeans. I was looking out for a nice top for this. Uh, my son chose this top and i never get to accessorize myself my profession doesn't demand so this thing and the rings i always loved uh, my little caps i paired it up with my white shoes and wanted to have this trendy look <laughs> always yeah i would i would just go like this without accessories <laughs> yeah i think you should have done that because those accessories are just not needed Okay. Yeah. Otherwise, normally I'm I'm never. I like your shoes person. and the choke with it, and the rest is good. Just those accessories are not needed. Okay. I like the look. It's a good cap. Otherwise, yeah, everything is good. Okay. I said Kashmiri. Well, I am in denim just just because I love to wear denims. I choose this because I think that was like. One time go, that's it. <laughs> Not to just wear it and that's it. I just uh, wear this uh, neck piece, try to cover. It. You know the Western clothes just cannot wear the Indian kind of jewelry or the oxidized. Your outfit is cute, but these accessories are not needed. Thank you. Thank you. Don't you even know? Even you know what you should have done and what yes, you should have done. So I guess, what is it? Tell us what you're going to not do. Bangles are not required, and the footwear should be sneakers. Or matching, you know, like something white or yes, yes. or even nude. It's all thank good. You. Well, thank you so thank much. You. So It represents, it relates to my passion for flying. I'm training to be a wing walker and a 